your boy, I am not a new. We're gonna try to prevent somebody from going to jail. Like a good detective. Should be. Excuse me, a good lawyer. Keep the innocent person out of jail. Let's, let's do that. Pretty late, so take your ass home. Did I speak to you? Chris Ross spoke to this dude. I certainly did. I don't forget faces. Even if it's digital. <laughs> Investigate Sauna Goten. Yeah, let's do that. Come on, dude. I know you didn't do that. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Which way you going? here yeah come on in friend actually I'm not a customer mind if I ask you a few questions sure what do you need I'm here about a murder the Yakuza who had his eyes gouged out oh a detective came by for the same thing wanted to know if their suspect was with us the night of the incident and you are a reporter something like that yeah pretty much and this is Hamura captain of the Matsugane family did he come in on the night of the crime? I'll tell you the same thing I told the cops. I make it a point not to remember anyone specific, you know? Hmm. You get a lot of customers in and out, huh? Up to the last train, at least. From there, it's only in till morning. You know how it is. People drop in, wait for the trains to start up again. Same as any other night. Interesting. So everyone who comes in stays till morning, huh? Then as long as I can prove Hamra was here, we'll have our alibi. Oh yeah, the cops mentioned something kind of similar. You guys don't have a security camera? Something we could check, see who was here? We do, but it deletes all its footage every three days. Privacy and all. It was already long gone by the time the cops came around. Got it. Thanks. Sorry to bother you. Hey, sure you might know. you're out here pretty often, right? Did you see a Yakuza head into Sonico 10 the night of December 3rd? Um... Why would I know that? You're crazy, mister. Thanks for insulting me. Hey, you have a sec? I'm looking for info on a Yakuza who went to Sonic O10 on the night of December 3rd. Nobody pays attention to me, so I'm not gonna pay attention to them. 
I knew you wasn't the right person to be talking to. It's worth a try anyway. Excuse me. I'm looking for info on a Yakuza who stopped by Sana Goten on the night of December 3rd. Did you see anything? This is the guy. Name's Hamura. I can't say I know him. There's tons of Yakuza around here. Though, now that you mention it, I remember something about a host getting smacked in the face that night. By a Yakuza? Yep. Don't think he got hurt too bad, though. Pretty sure it happened right around midnight. All this on the night of the incident. But when I went to check things out, the Yakuza was long gone. The host was just standing there shouting. That help at all? Hmm. Uh, any idea who the host was? Nah. I mean, they all kind of have that pretty boy look. Doubt I'd be able to recognize him if he was standing right in front of me. Does anyone else know about this? I don't know. Thanks for your help. Yeah, thanks, but no thanks. There's basically no help. I speak to this hey, guy? you have a sec? I'm looking for info on a Yakuza who went to Sonic Go 10 on the night of December 3rd. <laughs> you seriously expect me to remember something from that long ago? I'm trying to work here. Get lost! Don't get beat up. Don't do that. This alley, but that's not him. Excuse me. I'd like to know where's all these mosquitoes and flies coming from. Hate the hate my mother. Like it. I just don't like the penalties that come with it, like mosquitoes and gnats and flies. Rest up at Yamagami Detective Agency. I think we'll do that. Some health back. What? Oh, excuse me, miss. Watch where we going. Yo, you're still here? I thought you'd have left hours ago. I was gonna, but I realized all I do at home is pass out. Did go for a drink though. Oh, now you're having another. You know that bottle's mine. <laughs> well, Genda Sensei give you any work? Yep, probably thanks to the Doriaki. He wants me to scrounge up some evidence for a murder trial. You got this from Genda? I thought it was all about civil suits now. Criminals don't pay the bills, right? Well, this one comes straight from Matsugane-san. Turns out, Hamura went and got himself arrested. What the hell? For one of those Kyori clan murders. You mean that eye-gouging shit? Mm-hmm. Just dropped by the jail to see him. He claims he's innocent, though. Huh. Crazy.
Not interested? I can't say I blame you after what Hamra did. Booting you from the family was a low blow. If you want, I'll handle it solo. Look, don't worry about it. I'm the one who fucked up, not him. Either way, we've got the case. Count me in. <laughs> Good. What's up, Shintani? Morning, sunshine. I'm on Nakamichi Street. Yeah, and? You know Majori? Little cafe, killer coffee. Come here. Another impromptu meeting? Don't whine. I thought you liked keeping busy. We gotta get a bigger office. Did I purchase? Cause I don't remember purchasing anything. Really? Maybe I shouldn't check this. Can't, I can't. I can't. I can't walk away. I have to. I have to do this. Thank you, Jesus. Never remember buying all that shit anyway. Never bought that. Stay down. Upside down spinning kick. Oh, 
of it. It's definitely in here. It's a staircase. Hey, over here. Take a seat. Right. Anyway, I asked around near Sonic 10. Couldn't get anyone to back up Hamura's alibi, though. All right. Good work. So, what'd you call me out here for? Something came up. Take a look at this. Cops released it to the media. It's the camera footage from a morgue. Hamura and Kume are both in here, clear as day. Damn. Didn't realize the cops had their hands on this. This could be pretty bad. Ready? I'm gonna play it. Kume's the poor bastard getting dragged into the club. Explains why Kumi's buddy there is running for his life. Yep. Got a name, too. Akira Murase. Another Kyori thug. Word is, he hasn't left Kamurocho after getting interrogated by the cops. By the look of things, there must be a Kyori hideout nearby. Crazy how clear it all is. Hamura can't just talk his way out of this. Yep. And there's more. Take a look at this. One hour later, everyone leaves, except for Hamura and Kume. Even the owner hightails it. Wait, why would they stick around? Who knows? Our pal Hamura never mentioned this part. Now, this happened around 10 p.m., meaning there was another four hours before Kume's suspected time of death. The question is, what were the two of them doing all that time? Hamura said he threw Kume out of the club around midnight. After that, he left the club himself and went to the sauna. Right, but I wanna hear how it all went down from a different angle. That's where you come in, Yagami. You gotta talk to the guy in charge of Amor. Back up a second. Huh? You're the lawyer here. I get that. You decide what kind of investigation we need for the trial. But don't tell me how to do my job. Yeah, but aren't you gonna talk to him either way? All the same, I'd appreciate it if you'd stop barking orders at me.
Huh? Who are you? You need something? Actually, I was wondering if you have a minute to talk. About? About December 3rd. About the murder you and your boys accomplished to. Oh, I had that day off, man. If anyone's gonna know, it's our manager. He doesn't come in till nighttime, though. The manager, huh? This him? Oh, it is. What's his name? Aragaki. Think you could get in touch with him for me? We need to have a chat. I could try. Hold on. I knew this was gonna happen. He never has his phone on during the day. He usually hangs out near here, though. You mean in Kamurocho? Yep, usually. All right, I'll go take a look around. If you don't mind me asking, how? You're just gonna walk the whole city? No, I have a plan. Someone I can use to help me find him. With the name and photo, it shouldn't be much of a problem. Huh. If you say so, man. Good luck. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Out of the way!
Somehow I knew I'd find you here. Ah, uh, Yagamishi. You here to join this raid I'm about to get going? <laughs> Probably not, huh? What can I do for you? Got something I need a guy like you for, Tsukumo. This is Makoto Tsukumo. He's... well, he's a character. Some more detective work, I assume? What's the mark this time? A lost cat? Someone go missing? I'm looking for someone. The owner of Club Amour, a man named Aragaki. He's probably somewhere nearby, but I don't have time to scour all of Kamurocho either. <laughs> you got that right. Searching on foots for cavemen. Uh, here, can I see your phone for a quick second? My phone? Sure. What do we have here? You already have the chatter app, Yagamishi. I do? Oh. Well, you're in luck. In my hands, this stupid app becomes a powerful way to find people. Really? How? Hold on. I'm busting into their servers now. And there we go. Here, take a look. Go ahead, try searching for something. Maybe a name? That would be Aragaki. Okay, and let's limit the time period while we're at it. Say, today. See? That map will tell you the GPS position of all the relevant chatter posts. Not gonna lie, I had to give myself admin privileges to get that one, though. <laughs> wow. Hmm, 128 hits. We're gonna need to narrow down the search. Not sure what else we can put in, though. Didn't you say the name of the club, Yagamishi? Some crazy French word? Oh yeah, it's Club Amour. Great, Amore. let's try Aragaki and Club Amour. Well looky there, narrowed it down to one. So Aragaki wrote this, huh? Nope, just someone who saw him. That's still a massive hint though. See, it got posted only 10 minutes ago. Meaning the poster might still be nearby. So, if I were you, I'd get down there and see if you can find out where your man went. I marked the spot on your map, Yagamishi. Hope it comes in handy. Good luck out there. Appreciate, Appreciate it. it. Oh, to try to get out more, okay? Before he did. <laughs> Why on earth would I do that? Great mind stinker, like. Said it before he did. Gave thanks before the actual character. Taking steps down. Let's get over here, shall we? Let's see if we can find this guy. Should be headed this way. Must we? He's got a bat again. Next 
Are you Are you can Really guys? Got a second? I'm looking for the owner of a club called Amour. Actually, yeah. Just saw him. Must have really lost big time on the pachinko slots. Any idea where he was heading? Toward Taihei Boulevard. But sushi? <laughs> What's ten winnings what makes you stingy? Huh. Anyway, thanks a bunch. Taking up a lot of time out of the day. I'm gonna finish this chapter. That's with the story. Even though I'm just honestly enjoying the graphics and the, and the fighting mechanics. It's really, really fun. Which is the same as Yakuza with a lot of new features, as I said before. This is exactly the same as Yakuza. This is the exact same building from in Yakuza. Been over here. It's crazy. See you next time. Hmm? And this is going to only Aragaki just make San, me go and play the owner of Amor? all of the Yakuza's. <laughs> and this is exactly you are? what this is going to do. Yagami from the Yagami Detective Agency. I want to talk about what happened on the night of December 3rd. Oh, yeah? Sorry. Not ringing any bells. Come on. <laughs> you and I both sure, know then. that's not true. <laughs> well, it is. Why don't I jog your memory then? Or got you on camera, buddy. Yeah, I'm gonna reveal that. Take a look. It's not you? <sighs> That's not you, boy? On the night of the crime, that ain't you? you left a moor with these Matsugane goons. Leaving Hamura you, and Kume, the victim, alone in there. Men lie, women lie. You're knee Cameras deep in don't. this. <sighs> Guess I can't argue with that logic. Don't worry, I won't ask for anything too out there. Just a bit of your time. I'm working on Hamura's defense, and I'm hoping you're the silver bullet. Oh yeah? Whatever, I'll talk. I have something good. You actually tracked him down. Appreciate the help. Good ain't gonna now, for what went down around 9 p.m. on the night of December 3rd? Well, uh, Captain Hamura brought that Kansai punk Kume in here. Murder it was out of the, the blue. Caught me off guard. Were there any other customers here at the time? Just a few. They bailed when Hamura came busting in here. Who wouldn't? I ended up sending the girls home, too. Once everybody was gone, the Matsugane guys just laid into Kume for almost an hour. After this cut scene, I'm going uh, to you cut didn't hear that short, from me. I'll be back at You're you good. With another Don't worry. Of Lord's then right around Just 10, something kind of weird happened. Hamura kicked everyone out of the Don't club. Even me. It's your boy, I am not a noob. And the only AKA ones left inside were Hamura and Kume. AKA yep. Beyond Next Gen Gaming. You know why Hamura kicked That's everyone me. out? One and only. He said Kume reminded him of an old friend. Claimed they needed to have a chat, alone. At least that's how he worded it. And that didn't seem weird to anyone? Oh, the Matsugane boys had plenty to say about it. But if the boss tells you to leave, you get the heck out. No clue what went down in the club after that. Tell me about the camera out back. The broken one. Oh, that? Facts. How long's it been What's like up that? With the camera that don't work? For What's about a that? month. Some drunk asshole chucked a rock. <sighs> Cracked it right open. Yeah, it was just for show, though. Never actually worked in the first place. Not much use to me, then. Did you just sit and watch while the Matsugane tore into Kume? That's a fact. What do you mean? What, what else you could I have done? Right. 
Called the cops on them for one. Well, that's right. Not like they're especially good for business. Nor is a dead body in your club. Come on. They'd have killed me if I did that. And frankly, it didn't look like they were hurting him too bad. If anything, they were going easy on him. Meaning what? Like just smacking him around a bit. You know, nothing too serious. Once in a while, they'd hit him a little harder to make him bleed, I guess. The cops came by after the incident, right? A detective, yeah. Guy named Kuroiwa, apparently with organized crime. What did you tell him? Not a whole lot. Same stuff I told you. <sighs> Forensics was tearing this place apart. Trying to find bloodstains from Kume. You know, with that luminol stuff. I thought I'd wiped all that up before they got here, but that sure was a waste. <sighs> Turns out blood's tougher to clean up than I thought. Now they're convinced the murder happened here. Was there that much blood? Before you wiped it up, I mean. No, not really. I told you, they barely even made Kume bleed. Sounds like he didn't die here then. Well, I certainly wouldn't know. Well, thanks. This is a huge help. That's all I needed to know. Are we done here? Absolutely. Mind if I pick your brain again? Well, thanks. Nah, this is a huge good. help. We done here? I just want to make sure. Okay, we done. We done, son. Screw this place. I killed someone. Kaito, what's up? Hey, man. Where are you? Just left a club called Amour over on Supon Street. Amour? Isn't that one of the Matsugane joints? Yep. Hamura and the victim were apparently alone in here the night of the murder. Anyway, need something? Yep. Swing by the office when you're done there. What's up? Uh, it's no rush. I'll be You'll on see my when way. you get here. Later. Well, hope you guys enjoyed some of the detective working on Lost Judgment with your boy I Am Not A Noob. It's been episode three. Hope you guys enjoy what you see if you do I need you to comment like share hit the subscribe bell notification so you can know when i post the next new vid truly appreciate all my supporters you already know it's been your boy i am not a new it's been beyond next gen gaming and appreciate everything till next time peace and enjoy